Hello, and welcome to the St. Charles Community College Chamber Choir Spring 2021 Concert, Elements, Earth and Air, Fire and Water. My name is Becky Thorne. I have the pleasure of directing the wonderful group you're about to hear. We're going to be presenting 10 songs for you, all of which are at some point in the lyric exploring one of those four elements or a combination. I chose our first piece entitled Joy, which has this lyric. The text is by Sarah Teasdale. It says, I am wild. I will sing to the trees. I will sing to the stars in the sky. I love. I am loved. He is mine. Now at last I can die. I am sandaled with wind and with flame. I have heart fire and singing to give. I can tread on the grass or the stars. Now, at last, I can live. This is what life is all about, the pursuit of joy. How can we experience that joy? One of those ways is connecting with these elements, earth and air, fire and water. Please enjoy this first piece.
am so proud of our group for exploring this eight-part a cappella spiritual arranged by modern-day African-American composer Stacy Gibbs. This is Wade in the Water. Many of you might have heard this, might recognize it, um, but I think it's so interesting that the arranger chose to begin this spiritual with the word trouble. It starts with trouble because the lyric says that God's going to trouble the water. When we think of water, do we think of it as something that's moving or something that's still? It can be both. And what happens when we get in and we immerse ourselves and we wade in that water? And if it's troubled around you, what does that look like? What does that feel like? This is wade in the water. that we tend to think of as happening at the same time. But there is a place on our planet where they do. That place is Iceland. David Lance has brought us this piece entitled Fire and Ice, and it explores the geography that is so unique to Iceland. I wanted to read to you just a small description about this piece. 
He says, active volcanic activity, warring with the cold subarctic climate, yields attention captured in music true to the surprisingly rich Icelandic cultural tradition, rhythmic, mournful, and dreamlike. The lyrics and music paint vivid images by turn menacing, mysterious, and playful. This was an interesting piece for our choir. We had a lot of fun learning it, and we do hope that you enjoy this performance of Fire and Ice. modern-day Norwegian composer who is extremely popular among choral musicians and we are so grateful to have a string quartet come and play this beautiful piece with us entitled Tundra. 
The lyric of Tundra says, wide, worn, and weathered, sacred expanse of green and white and granite gray, snowy patches strewn, anchored to the craggy earth, unmoving, while the clouds dance across the vast eternal sky. I loved that this description described earth, earth as unmoving, uh, granite, right? Something stable. Earth can be our foundation, our base, where we plant our roots. And at the end of the piece, we look up and we see clouds dancing across the eternal sky. This is the element of air, and air is moving above the earth. Air is what we breathe in and what gives us life. This is tundra. What happens when we combine the elements of water and fire together? Well, 
Boiling water gives us what? Steam heat. This next piece is, oh, how beautiful this finely woven earth. We are bound in threads of joy, threads of grief, of soul. Your tears fall from my eyes. My joy rings in your laughter. We are bound together. Give me your sorrow. I will stretch across to you over green pine and sparkling lake. How my heart beats with yours. You will feel how my heart beats with yours. I know your heart's journey. It is my own. Oh, how beautiful our finely woven earth.
Fields of Gold is a song that was written and recorded by the artist Sting. Many of you are familiar with this piece. We're going to be presenting it in an eight-part a cappella harmony. Its text is so wonderful. It combines three different elements in various ways. It has the element of fire, where it describes the sun in its jealous sky and how hot that is, how colorful that is. It describes the air in the west wind moving and comparing that to the kiss of a lover. How life-giving the air is. And of course, its title, Fields of Gold, the walking through the fields of gold, the children running through the barley. We make our memories in life with the elements. And sometimes connecting with those elements can trigger nostalgia within us. This is Fields of Gold.
Craig Hella Johnson has brought us this beautiful arrangement of this well-known folk song, The Water is Wide, featuring cello and soprano solo. The text of this is very familiar to most of us, and it speaks to the need to cover a distance over water and how the water is wide and the water is deep. And I don't know in life, I don't know if I'm going to sink or if I'm going to swim or if I'm going to have a boat to help me cross that river. And what I do know is that when we do it together, love carries us across, no matter how wide the water is. Love carries us across.
This next piece, Water Fountain, is probably the most unique piece of music that I have ever worked with a choir on, and they love it. They love singing it, and it's very rhythmic and enjoyable. It has some lyrics that, at first glance, may feel a little bit nonsensical. Uh, however, they really paint this picture of uh, perhaps some adolescents who have to travel a long way to go get water from a well and bring it back to their village. And so you can imagine as you're listening what songs they might make up or with the things that they might talk about on their journey together, how they see the world, how they're growing into it, what things they appreciate and what things they see could be changed and could be improved. Water is something that we cannot live without. Hope you enjoy Water Fountain.
I do hope that you have enjoyed our Elements concert, Earth and Air, Fire and Water. The choir has had a wonderful semester, and though we would have loved to have been able to be with you live in performance with the pandemic, we felt this was the safest way to be able to share our music with you. So thank you for staying tuned. If you enjoyed this video, would you let us know? Leave a comment, share the video, check out the rest of our music ensemble videos. We would love for you to experience all that SCC has to offer. If you yourself are interested in joining one of our large ensembles, we have those available in the fall semester and the spring semester, and they're open to community members. So please contact me, Becky Thorne, at bthorne at stchaz.edu. I would love to connect with you. We're closing today with the element of air. Renee Clausen has brought us a masterful piece of music entitled, All That Hath Life and Breath. Praise ye the Lord. We have the breath of life in us. We breathe in the air into our lungs. And what choice do we have but to sing? Music unites us. It's our universal language. Thank you so much for being with us. Please enjoy our last piece. Thank you.